Well, hello guys and girls, I hope you're doing well back once again for moving on up. Before we even get into this, I know there's going to be comments about stat attack. We want stat attack. Where is stat attack? Can we have stat attack? Can you post stat attack? Can you play stat attack? Right. <laughs> I've actually posted a video, guys, explaining what's going on with stat attack, what's going to happen. Is it coming back? Is it not coming back? So if you're interested in anything about stat attack, guys, I'm going to link it in the description below. Take five seconds out of your day, go to that. It's a text video, so you can see on the screen exactly when I'm talking about stat attack. Uh, just go to that one. That should be able to answer any questions that you have with regards to uh, that series. Uh, I love it myself, so that kind of gives you an inkling about what might be happening. But uh, this first game was actually very difficult. He had a good defence. I think he had Poyol as well. Uh, this team that I'm playing with at the moment, uh, I've actually built a hybrid on my main channel with a lot better players than this team. And I'm finding the division a lot harder on my main account. This team, until I played with this this hybrid, I didn't realise how good this team I've built on this account is. It's, it's a fantastic... Um, cheap really it's not that expensive um bundesliga team i'm actually going to be making some purchases in, in this episode as well guys which is uh, obviously fantastic all the money has been made from games the only time i will not buy a player look at this this is why this is why i brought in voice he's so good guys um as i said before this is a full proper road to glory uh, glory glory rules only money gained from playing games or selling players, blah, 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 is used to buy players. The only time I bring in a player like I did with Vice was if I actually win a division as the champion. So not just win the division or get promoted, but actually win it as a champion. Then I could bring one player. Uh, I'm not going to bring in an 100 grand player because that kind of ruins the series. So I brought in Vice last time, you know, because he's such a fantastic goalkeeper. But we're going by Panda here. Just kind of a replacement left back for Kalic. Um... They're about the same in stats. I think Kadlic beats him in, in a few. And then we bring in Shakiri. Now, a lot of you say Shakiri is an absolute monster. I've never used him before uh, on my main account. As you know, I don't really play games on my main account. Um, so I brought him in this team. Uh, I think I used him in this game. He doesn't really do too much in this game. But this guy has a quite a nice looking team. Uh, he actually has Panda as well. Uh, Mandzukic as his striker. But Arnautovic really should be scoring that one, to be honest with you. Uh, Douglas gets a yellow for that and that's, that's that would have been a nice overhead uh, overhead kick to score I call it overhead bicycle kick which I know it really isn't uh, but Juve gets on the head uh, on the end of a corner which is fantastic his I can't say enough good things about Juve guys just check him out he's like 600 coins 700 coins and you will not be um, disappointed in any aspect of his game uh, it's he's just crazy uh, Mandzukic here does go and score that goal kind of deserving he was pressing for a lot of the game uh, this is a nice little move by me. Uh, his keeper does well. Uh, Panda here probably should have, instead of going for goal, probably should have passed it off. But that does end 1-1, which, you know, isn't bad. Vice here made seven saves, which is very good for a game. You know, seven saves from a goalkeeper does keep you in the match, as you'll see by match details here. He had six shots, six on target, and only scored one goal. Come up against this guy. This is going to obviously, as you know, be the final game of the episode. This guy on every imaginable level was better than me. His defending was insane. As you'll see by the final stats at the end of the game, guys, I had the lion's share of possession, but couldn't do anything of it. For things like this, he was just always in my face, always where my players were. Nice save again by Voice to save that, because that probably would have gone straight onto the head of his player. Uh, just this guy was insane. He takes the lead. Um, you know, unlucky not to score with Emineke. Unlucky for me that Vice didn't get to that, to be honest. But he that was a deserved lead, to be honest. But we're not done there. We're almost on 80 minutes. Go for a slide tackle. Do not do that if you're nowhere near the player, guys. And we go and score with Elia. But uh, the game does, I believe, end 1-1. It does. But as I said earlier, guys, if you're interested in knowing about Stats Tech or anything else, check out the video in the description, guys. <coughs> it would mean a lot to me, and it really does help me out if you check them out. Make sure you drop a like on this as well, guys. I'm loving this series. I'm loving playing with this team. Go and sign Mandzukic, actually, as well for the team, which is going to be a very, very good signing, I feel. A good uh, rotation player for the striker. So here's the team, guys. This is the final team at the moment. Hope you have a good day. I'll speak to you all.